This is a leech. If it was sucking your blood, the only, only things you had nearby were three items MSG, incense, and energy drain. Which one do you think would make it detach from your skin quickly and scurry away? Let's wait and see. No more chit chat. Let's drop it into the box with MSG. Since MSG has a several umami flavor, let's check if it will take the initiative to touch the MSG because of that taste. And if it does, what kind of reaction we'll get from it? Oops. The leech just fell. Both its tail and head got covered in MSG, but its mouth didn't. Totally not what we expected. We saw it go for the MSG on its own once it smelled that savory flavor. So will it try to eat the MSG later? Let's keep watching. You can see that thanks to the stimulation from the MSG, the leech's body has started secreting sticky fluid. This fluid doesn't just dilute the MSG's irritation on its body. It also mixes with the MSG's savory taste. As its mouth explodes around, it finally gets to taste it MSG. MSG too. Suddenly, it just stretched its head over and curled the MSG up with its body. This seems to contradict its earlier stress response of secreting fluid. Logically, it should be avoiding the MSG, not touching it with its mouth parts like this. Could it be that the silver taste of the MSG is attracting it? Let's keep watching. Right now, it's that it's a bit like a person who's drunk. Its movements look pretty abnormal. See that? It's even twisting around. Oh, there it goes again. Taking another bite of MSG. Do you all remember how the leech reacted in that short circle video we did before? Back then, it acted like this too. <laughs> But it quickly started regurgitating blood. <laughs> so far, after eating this MSG, the leech hasn't regurgitated any blood. It should be safe for now. The leech just flipped over. We can't tell if it's super comfortable or in discomfort. Since we still can't tell if the MSG can repel the leech, why not pour some water in? That way, the leech will be in full contact with the MSG. And we can see how it reacts next. Now you can see, the niche in the MSG water is starting to change color. The yellow stripes on both sides of its body have turned red. It still hasn't regurgitated blood, but this color change seems like a bad sign for the leech. Next, let's grab another leech and see how it reacts to the incense. We're using bad flow incense. Once we light it, the smoke will start floating downward in a minute. It looks like the leech isn't used to this bright, dry environment, so it just walked away. Now, the incense smoke is starting to flow down slow, but wait, it's drifting the opposite way. Uh... Well, in that case, let's just place the leech right under the small outlet. Whoa, the leech is reacting strongly. It's thrashing around trying to escape this smoky arrow. Clearly, it hates its smoke. Still trying to escape every which way. Holy shit! Look at that. It's already regurgitating blood. Well, when it's time for rain, it rains. When things are meant to happen, they happen. We'll just let it be. But we let it be into the energy drink. After being in that dry environment just now, the leech seems to really love this liquid environment of the drink. It started scurrying around, and there's not even a hint of it trying to climb up the side of the box. Could it be that energy drink is different from the previous two? Wait a sec. The leech is gone quiet, and its body is starting to secret that sticky fluid again. Looks like I was wrong. What the fuck? I just thought you were about to kick the bucket and was about to rescue you. Now you start going crazy again. This plot twist is even more unexpected than a short drama. Seriously. One hour later. Still swimming around like crazy. This leech is almost turning into a water snake. If there were a leech sports competition, this synergy drink would definitely count as a stimulant. Totally bad stuff. You guys watching right now, see that? If you ever chose energy drink, it'll suck you dry like a mummy. <laughs>